and welcome to Brandy's Poetry Corner, reading uh, the poems, some of the poems of D. H. Lawrence, who, as I said before, wrote a lot of poems. Um, I picked this one partly because I was drawn by the title, Know Deeply, Know Thyself More Deeply, but it's about love and relationships and stuff. So this is Know Deeply, Know Thyself More Deeply by D. H. Lawrence. Go deeper than love, for the soul has greater depths. Love is like the grass, but the heart is deep, wild rock, molten, yet dense and permanent. Go down to your deep old heart, woman, and lose sight of yourself, and lose sight of me, the me whom you turbulently loved. Let us lose sight of ourselves and break the mirrors, for the fierce curve of our lives is moving again to the depths, out of sight, in the deep, dark, living heart. But say, in the dark, wild metal of your heart, is there a gem which came into being between us? Is there a sapphire of mutual trust, a blue spark? Is there a ruby of fused being, mine and yours, an inward glint? If there is not, oh, then leave me, go away. For I cannot be bullied back into the appearance of love any more than August can be bullied to look like March. Love out of season, especially at the end of the season, is merely ridiculous. If you insist on it, I insist on departure. Have you no deep old heart of wild womanhood, self-forgetful and gemmed with experience and swinging in a strange unison of power with the heart of the man you are supposed to have loved? If you have not, go away. If you can only sit with a mirror in your hand, an ageing woman posing on and on as a lover, in love with a self that now is shallow and withered, your own self, that has passed like a last summer's flower, then go away. I do not want a woman whom age cannot wither. She is a made-up lie, a dyed immortelle of infinite staleness. Thank you for more poems read by me. Some a lot cheerier than that. <laughs> Look me up, Brandy Pearson, on YouTube. Thank you.